In this app review, we're looking at the funny titled Tinker Rink. Essentially, with Tinker Rink, you're looking down on an ice rink. Some folks are coming to the ice rink, and they want to have fun. And the way they have fun, you pull them out onto the ice, and then you can make a path for them to follow. And you double tap on them for them to do tricks. So you could, for example, have them spin and that sort of thing. And you need them to do those tricks, because if they don't do tricks, they're going to get bored. And if they get bored, they leave. And if too many people leave, well then you lose. So you can pull out as many people as you want to. There are some bonuses for having a certain number of people. I will tell you, you get enough people out there, it gets very complicated very fast. My one little note here about this game was, phew, that's it. That's all I have in my notes. But at any rate, you double tap on the people, keep them happy, keep them interested in skating. You can also single tap and they'll skate backwards. It's not always easy to tell looking at them whether they're skating forwards or backwards because you have this top-down view. So two different ways to do it. You could have four or five people out there and just have them do fancy patterns and tricks, or you could go crazy like this and just have as many people out there at once as possible, but you will start to see people start to leave pretty quickly if you do it that way. So that's a quick look at Tinker Rink. There goes someone now. For the iPhone and iPod Touch. For the digitallifestyle.tv, I'm Ryan Ritchie.